handlebar. The handlebar is installed with four screws, okay? So when you receive your bike, your handlebars may be off, okay? It comes with four screws, and there's a screw and a washer. It's best to have a washer, but if you don't have a washer, that's no big deal. You just leave the washer off, or you can go to a Home Depot and grab it. These are four millimeter screws, okay? Four millimeter Allen wrench screws. Okay, okay so this one, these just come off. Four screws, they come off. And you know the handlebar just come off. Now you know this handlebar is fatter here, so you can actually slide it a little bit. Th this is 31 millimeters, 31.8 millimeters goes in here. Okay? You can also, while having it loose, you can rotate your position of where you want the handlebars to go. Now when you receive your bike, the handlebar is off. So what you want to do is put it in, put the thing in, and you take the two screws and you tighten them completely from the bottom first, okay? So you go ahead and put all four screws in, but you're going to tighten only the bottom ones. So you put all four screws in. I think just throw in a few turns. The key is you want to tighten it the bottom ones first, okay? Okay. So once all four screws are in, again, you're going to tighten the bottom ones first. So you're going to center the if you Again, the exact center is not a big deal. You, if you're off by a little bit, that's fine. Okay, but you're going to tighten the bottom ones first. So you're going to go in all the way, tighten the bottom ones. And then once the bottoms are tight, then you tighten the top ones. Okay? So the top ones, you just put them in just to, to set the position. But really, you're going to tighten the bottom ones first. Okay, okay so we're going to go ahead and... Rotate the one to the position that you like. We're going to set it about the center, right about the center. Okay, then you're going to tighten completely the bottom ones first, okay? So the, and if you look down, you'll see that there's no crack on the bottom. You, you point the camera right on the bottom, you'll see it's all tightened there. So the gap is on the top side. Okay, okay so now these are bottom are, are tightened. Okay? Now, the, the handlebar should still be a little bit loose, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to now tighten the top one. And then, again, you don't have to go too hard, you just tighten it so it doesn't rotate. And then just alternate it until you see it reasonably tight, and then you're good. Okay? And make sure it doesn't move, and then you're good.